Kat, congratulations. Uh, what's the immediate feeling after winning this title? Uh, <laughs> relief, uh, incredible, uh, happy for, for many, many people. So it's a massive achievement for the massive contenders and opponents we had uh, in this, this league in difficult lockdown and for everyone knows. So yeah, incredible satisfied. Like you were saying there, the season has been like no other season that anyone's experienced. The schedule has been grueling and the COVID restrictions have made things all complicated everywhere. How have the players been so consistent in that context? Yeah, every day. So the league is every day. So in uh, Cups, in knockout games, everything can happen, but the league is every day, every day, and we did it incredible. So I think everything started 19 December when we won in, in, uh, in Southampton until 7 of March when we lost against United. So that period, so 19 December, 7 of March, we won, we won uh, absolutely everything, all the games, and that make us, you know, the Premier League be possible. There seems to be a real togetherness in the squad teamwork across the whole squad. How proud are you of the way they behave and they apply themselves every single day? Well, not just the players, everyone. So here, normally the focus are the manager in the press, it's the manager in the press conference and the players on the pitch, but there are a thousand, thousand people working behind the scenes, like made this possible. So, so the Premier League is so nice. So win the title, the Premier League, always I said, is the most important thing because every three days and every 10 months, 11 months, Fighting for the you know the big 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 teams against you know uh, uh, teams that maybe they are not fight for uh, you know to win the Premier League but they are so complicated to beat them so and we were there so the achievement so I think it's this decade so then ten years Manchester City won five times you know the Premier League this is the I think resume I think everything what this club uh, has done in the last yeah ten years since. Uh, uh, Sheikh Mansour took over the club, Khaldun as uh, our chairman, leading, leading the rest of the people, and we did it. So, so big compliment for everyone. Like you're alluding to there, that's three Premier League titles in four years. It's not often teams in England show that kind of consistency over such a long period. That must make you proud. Yeah, we are part of the, I'm pretty sure, Manchester City in these 10 years. Like I remember many, many players, many managers that create this kind, this kind of thing for, uh, yeah, it's part of that. So, yeah, when we achieve five Premier Leagues in this, the most toughest, I've been in Spain, I've been in uh, Germany, and I can say this is the toughest one. This is the toughest league, I would say by far, and uh, for many, many reasons, and achieve five, uh, five Premier Leagues in 10 years means, means a lot for this organization. So, from the most important guy since the, you know, the, the the less recognized uh, guy externally, so a big, big compliment. The fans have obviously been missed inside the Etihad so far. Some are outside the Etihad as we speak now, celebrating. What's it been like for you to not have their support this season? And have you got a message for them? When no, I'm looking for Everton game. Like we will leave the title, the trophy and 10,000, I think, 10,000 people is coming to the stadium will be, will be incredible. In Carabao Cup, just few people there was completely different. So I had the feeling like Liverpool last season, like uh, were an incredible deserved champion, like uh, they defend the crown this season, like uh, could not celebrate with the people. It's quite similar this season, like uh, we are not there, but uh, yeah, we're going to do the last, last game. And uh, this business with other people is not the same. And hopefully next season we can enjoy all the Premier League uh, all the Premier League teams. I would like to say too that congratulations for the Premier League to organize or be possible to organize the Premier League. All the referees for our bad moments on the pitch and off the pitch, for the journalists for our biggest smiles when we win, and big sad moments when we don't win, uh, and everybody involved, you know, to win this uh, this incredible. You know, the Premier League is the the most satisfied one because uh, means a lot for all of us.